dominate. Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Combo here. Welcome to some more Black Ops 2 Wii U footage. Today, I'm actually bringing you guys a pretty nice scoring gameplay here. I'm going to be using the higher streaks, and that's something you guys aren't used to me doing or, you know, seeing on YouTube, I guess, on my channel. I'm more of a guy who runs the lower streaks, as you guys know. 90% of my videos, I use, like, the UAV, the counter UAV, you know, lightning strike, something like that, but... Um, in this video, I tried to switch it up here. I'm using the UAV, uh, uh, Orbital VSAT, and of course the Swarm. And I do end up picking, I think, up uh, one or two Swarms in this gameplay. So, uh, for, for some reason this day, I just, you know, the day I got this gameplay, I felt like um, going for the higher streaks and stuff. Because um, it's something I haven't done a lot in Black Ops 2, but it's, it's a different, it's a kind of like different approach to the game that you have to take if you're going for the higher streaks. For me, personally, like I said, I just like to, you know, not be pressured, I guess you could say. Because when I'm using the higher streaks, I feel a little bit pressured to play a little bit more defensively and try to get those higher streaks and all that kind of stuff. But when I'm using the lower streaks, I, I feel like more comfortable. I can just run around, do whatever I want. It's not that big of a deal if I die, you know, short of a UAV or short of a counter UAV. So, um, and at the same time, I think those smaller score streaks are just as effective as the bigger score streaks. You know, obviously an orbital VSAT is a lot better than a UAV, but, you know, a UAV is still really effective for your team and for yourself. And, um, you know, the counter UAV is as well, you know, if you're going up against a team full of pretty good players who are, you know, have been playing Call of Duty for a while now, they definitely utilize their, you know, mini-map, and if you take that away from them, even for 30 seconds, it could, you know, throw them off just a little bit, and like I said, you know, I'm more of a team-oriented guy, I like to play the objective, I like to kind of um, come out on top, you know. When I play Call of Duty, I always want to win, so that's that's kind of why I'm a, like a lower streak guy, but like I said, this day, I just felt like going for, you know, the higher scoring gameplays, and I have a few more gameplays from this day that I recorded. I think a 64-2 and two or something like that. Um, you know, just the higher scoring gameplays, and maybe I could go for 100 plus one day in 6v6 domination. You know, I'm not really a ground war fan, but maybe I could do that as well, we'll see. Um, but I'm using the AN-94 silencer, you guys can see that. This is now officially my favorite gun on my combat record. It used to be the PDW, but I kind of uh, stopped using that a while ago, and I wanted to get a new gun, gun on my combat record, so the AN-94 was it. And I think this gun is a, is a pretty good gun overall, you know, it's really good with the silencer and the stock, which is something I use on it all the time. Um, you guys probably know all the good class setups now, but um, that's pretty much it for the gameplay, guys. Let me know if you would like to see some of these higher scoring gameplays where I kind of don't play as aggressively, but I do get, you know, more kills, a better kill death ratio, all that kind of stuff. I do get the higher score streaks, and, um, you know, I'll definitely bring that to you guys. So, for this commentary, guys, I just wanted to let you know that I'll be starting a question and answer kind of series thing on my channel, or maybe once or twice a week or something like that. Just when I pretty much have nothing else to talk about, I'll do a question and answer video. And I thought it would be a good way to get you guys involved as well, you know, if you want to learn a little bit more about me or whatever what I do in my free time or whatever just you know you can ask me the questions and I'll put them all together in a video so I think what I'm gonna be doing is if you have any questions you can message me them or leave them in the comments below and then I'll go through them and pick the ones that I think would be would make a good video you know you can ask me pretty much anything um, you know obviously if it's too inappropriate or whatever I'll just leave it out of the video or if I just think it's not good enough to answer or too personal something like that um, then I'll just leave it out of the video obviously but you know you can pretty much ask me anything you want to know about me um, you know to the extent I mean I'm a youtuber you probably don't really want to know too much about me but you guys have probably seen it on some other channels but I think I should just bring it back here to my channel I did it in the past a few times I'm definitely trying to um, you know be more active on my youtube channel this summer I want to get a few series started that I have in mind and I'm gonna try to definitely get them started here on my channel soon hopefully I can do them this summer and as well as that, I, I've been kind of thinking lately that I've been kind of dropping off, I guess, with helping out some of the smaller guys in the YouTube community, I guess, for the Wii U. Um, I used to help out a lot of people in the past with, like, before the Wii U came out, I pretty much had a series um, where you guys pretty much uploaded to my channel once a week, or you submitted your videos to my channel, and I would pick the ones to upload. You know, just that kind of stuff, because, you know, YouTube in the, in the past, likes, comments, and favorites, or all that kind of stuff, they definitely helped out a lot more than they do now. So, like, in the past, I used to be able to leave a like on somebody's videos, you know, someone smaller, and it would be able to get them, like, you know, an extra 50 views or something small, something small like that, but still at the same time, it, it was helpful to them. Um, but now, I kind of see that, you know, if I like somebody's video, it doesn't really help out as much, if at all. 
so I'm gonna try to maybe start up a subscriber series again where you know I could maybe upload some of your guys' videos or I could do something with liking your videos or commenting on them or watching them whatever I'm um, still gonna try to figure that one out and I definitely like I said want to start getting back into helping out the other guys because I think that's one of my stronger points I guess to my channel like like I said in the past I helped out a lot of channels and all that kind of stuff but YouTube has definitely changed and it's not really that easy to help out someone anymore as it used to be I think at least but um, that's pretty much the gameplay guys it's coming to an end here like I said the final score is 50 and 2 but all you have to do if you want to know anything about me just leave the comments below or send me a message to my inbox and I will get through them all I'll try to you know screen capture each one put it on the screen so if you leave a comment you can possibly see your name on the screen if that's you know anything cool to you or if that's something you look forward to but I look forward to the series. Hopefully, you know, you guys can learn a little bit more about me. Hopefully, it's more entertaining than just a regular commentary nowadays. Um, you guys know I'm more of a gameplay kind of talking about gameplay guy. Um, you know, and it's like, how, how long now? Like seven months into Black Ops 2. You guys pretty much know what's, what the deal is. So, I'm running out of things to talk about, things to do. I like doing live commentaries, so I'm going to try to do some of them as well, but. I just, I, I like doing live commentaries when nobody's home or nobody's in the room, so it's kind of awkward when somebody's in the room and I just don't like doing them, so I gotta wait for the perfect time to do them, but I'm just rambling on at this point. I hope you guys did enjoy it, and thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.